Okay, a fun one here on deck. 33, 133 pounds. Vito Arusha darting into Ryan Crookham's legs. And pulling the leg up tall, trying to catch that far ankle, but Crookham not letting him get it. Now Vito pulling him all the way back to the center of the mat. Climbs up the leg, comes to the waist, roll through defense from Crookham. Still no takedown, and Vito can't get that far ankle. Can Vito pull Crookham back in like he was able to do before? Keeping those hands in, and no, they go out of bounds. Good defense there from Crookham. I told you it'd be a fun one. Arushal, your number one ranked dress at 133 pounds. National champion last year. Actually tournament OW last year. Then would go on to win a world title as well. Crookham, one of the top recruits overall. Coming out of high school a couple years ago. Redshirted last year for the Mountain Hawks. Beat his teammate Connor McGonigal here earlier today. Number six ranked in the country, Connor McGonigal. And now it's Crookham getting to the legs. Good defense here from Arujao though. He's gonna push off knees, slide back, try and break that lock of Crookham. Not able to break the lock, but will earn the stalemate. Halfway through this first period, no points yet, but good amount of action. Both wrestlers getting to the legs. And it should be noted, Crookham took neutral against McGonagall earlier this tournament. Will that come into play? Vito doing his little trickster back of the hand to the face technique he likes to do. I call it the sniff my hand. And nice counter by Vito. Perfectly timed the attack off of Crookham's attack to get on the board first. Nice work there by Crookham escaping quick. Only eight seconds of riding time for Vito. Now with 30 to go, we'll see if one of these wrestlers commits to a hard attack and tries to sneak a takedown late here. And it's Vito shooting in and getting a stall call on Crookham, but Crookham on Vito's legs, and he picks up the takedown. Arusha to his feet, and out of bounds, no change. Vito takes a deep breath as he slowly walks back to the center of the mat. Not, not a tired deep breath, but just a collect myself deep breath. Vito sitting out now to his feet, trying to cut and escape. The Crookham drops down to the ankle to hold him down and take a lead into period number two, four to three. You hear a large cheering going on from behind me. Crookham, a hometown kid, originally from Hellertown, PA, just down the road here from Bethlehem, stayed home. Went to Lehigh. Vito Rusha staying home as well, originally from New York. Going to Cornell. Vito jumping the gun just a little bit. Crookham up to his feet, fighting hands, now blocking off, trying to avoid the mat return, but Vito sucks him back. Crookham right back up to quad pod and feet. Again, Vito pulling him back, and he's going to be close to backs. 
Can't get backs, but slips the right boot in. Vito so long, he's almost got this cradle locked up. And remember, I mentioned Crookham took neutral against teammate McGonagall. I thought bottom might be an issue or a factor in this match, and it could be as Vito's approaching a minute of riding time, 51 seconds, as we hit the halfway point here in period number two. Crookham again, quad pod. Neither rest are advancing here in this position. Now Crookham up to his feet and there's the escape. With 40 seconds to go in period number two, Vito darts in from way out. Vito did amass a minute 11 of riding time. And Vito looking for the counter, head in the hole. And that does it, no takedown. Again, good defense from Crookham. And Ryan Crookham going into the third period with a five to three lead over the returning national champion, Vito Rujau. Now, Vito does have a minute 11 of riding time, so Crookham gonna have to ride him for at least 11 seconds, or at least 12 seconds, rather, Go, Ryan. to erase this riding time. No wrestler been worn for stalling yet. Nice job, Ryan. And 10 seconds. Come off the clock, Crookham's still on top. Vito up to his feet, and there's the escape, but Crookham erases riding time. He still has a one point lead. Does Crookham have the gas in the tank to withstand the oncoming onslaught from Vito? There it is, Vito, single leg, tries to slip the right leg in. Again, Crookham rolling through, far edge. He's gotta be careful about danger. Far ankle scramble and ankle ankle 50-50 position here. So we're gonna get a stalemate. And you can feel the energy in this gym right now. With Crookham 74 seconds away from a massive upset. Touch and go, touch and go, right there. Touch and go. Vito, no strange out of close matches though. One minute! Again, Crookham has not been warned for stalling, so he can give up one. Vito double, now coming across the waist on the edge. And they go out of bounds. Let's go, Ryan! Oh, come on, come on! And Vito jumping the gun again, and that's his second caution. Next one is a point. Vito got to be a little careful now. Pick your spots, pick your spots. Vito diving into the leg. Crookham in the court. And Brian Crookham with the takedown. Huge takedown for Ryan Crookham. Yeah, he's broke. And Vito completely flattened out here. Broke his ass. Be smart, dude. Spiral ride. 18 seconds to go. Vito needs something big. An escape and a takedown would tie it, but 
Vito's not going to get it. Ryan Crookham is for real. Ryan Crookham has arrived on the college scene. Takes out returning national champion. Ryan effing Crookham. <laughs>